everybody. Today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to do a tail lift on a scooter. I always wear a helmet when I'm scootering, so safety first. So let's get into the video. The step to doing a tail lift on a scooter is you need to know how to bunny hop. So bunny hop is basically when you pull the scooter up with your entire body. So it looks like this. So you can start off going small, just like this, but then gradually do a tail lift. You'll have to go up pretty high like this. So that's the first step of doing. The second step to doing a tail lift on a scooter is your wrist motion. So you have to be able to use your wrist to spin the deck around um, when you're in midair. So to help with that, you can just do the simple thing: you just move, move the bar up and down, and the scooter deck will spin. You just do this a lot, or you don't have to do a lot, but you gotta do that to be able to do a tail lift. The third step to doing a tail lift on a scooter is that you have to be able to flip the scooter with your foot. So an easy way to do that is to, to put your um, pull your back foot right in front of the brake, and then you can wheel your knot, and then you just flick it, catch it, and then you can just keep repeating that. We'll probably have to do this a good amount because this is probably the most important step in, this, in a tail lift. So just keep doing this a ton. The final step of doing a tail lift is you have to put all three of the steps together. So remember, the first step was the bunny hop. The second step was the wrist motion. Then the third step was being able to flip it, flip it with your foot. So... When you add all them together, you have to have the bloody half, and then you also have to have the wrist motion. But then you also have to add to that the, the flick. So just keep practicing those steps, and hopefully sooner or later you'll land a tail lift. It takes time to land a tail lift. You're not going to land one in one day. It'll probably take longer. So keep practicing those three steps. And if you practice, you'll eventually be able to do this. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, make, make sure to smash that like button, subscribe, and enjoy this video of me doing tail with this.